do that if that has to be the case here moving forward? Well, I think it's, you know, Tevin's been chomping at the bit to, you know, to, to get that opportunity, you know, quite honestly, not nothing at the expense of, of, of uh, free. You know, we, we all want to get him back as soon as possible when he's ready. But the reality of it is when you're a running back or you're a receiver, you want to get those touches as many as you can get. And so mm -hmm. uh, I was really proud of Tevin when he got his opportunity last week to show what he could do. Uh, ran the ball well, you know, played a complete game, had, even had the one run call back there at the end of the game. Mm -hmm. And so, um, you know, we feel very comfortable and confident in Tevin. If, if, this, is, if this is his ball game Monday night, that, you know, he's going to go out and play well for us. Can you also talk, I know you talk about it every week, but with Julio, you know, as we're starting to see more and more opportunities and stuff like that and everything like that, what do you see and still from the, the opportunities to score for him? Well, you know, again, you know, you you want to maximize your opportunities as a team when you get in the red area. And we've had games when we've been really good in the red zone. You know, last week was one of those games when we, when we executed the way we wanted to and did the things we wanted to, had a couple missed ops. We've had other games when we weren't so good. And so I think the reality of it is you game plan, you try to put your best players in the best position to be successful. Obviously, Julio is, is, is that guy for us. And when the defense presents those opportunities, you want to take advantage of them. Um, a, we haven't gotten the best looks for those ops, and two, we haven't taken as, as good an advantage of them as, as I'd like. And so we keep striving for it, we keep grinding for it, but I do know this, the attention he gets makes life a lot easier for a lot of the other guys, and I mm -hmm. think we're seeing the benefits of that. And, and Taylor, Gabriel, and uh, Hardy, were they beneficiaries of that last week in uh, you know, their plays? Well, I think so. I think, I think Taylor... For, since I've been here, the last two weeks has played really good football for us. Mm -hmm. And um, I think that makes everybody else's job a little easier. I think it, it puts more attention on Gabe and that opens things up maybe for Who or Mo or Hardy or Hooper. And so that's when we're really rolling. Not to take it away from Julio. We want to get that guy the ball every chance we get when, when those opportunities present themselves. And so we're just trying to make you defend everybody and knowing when we get our shots with Julio, we can take advantage of it.